nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Ignition, lift off, simplify, aim high. Go Falcon, go Dragon. Vehicle is pitching down range. T plus 30 seconds, Falcon 9 with the Crew Dragon capsule is heading east from pad 39A. Everything looking good right now. As we get ready for max dynamic pressure, we are now throttling down the first stage engines on Falcon, Falcon power 9. And telemetry nominal. Everything continues to look good. We're approaching the period of maximum dynamic pressure. Vehicle is supersonic and passing through maximum dynamic pressure. You've heard we're supersonic, we're through max Q. We're getting ready now to throttle the engines back up on the first stage. Stage one, throttle up. There's the call out. Okay, the major activity coming up in just over 10 seconds. Shut down and drag an escape from the Falcon 9. Miko, Dragon launch escape initiated. Dragon's away. And you can hear some really loud uh, cheering in the room. Okay, you just saw a bright flash there. It looks like Falcon that may be Falcon 9 breaking up. We've got some loud cheers um, here in Hawthorne. The, the folks that just watched live the Dragon separate. The next milestone we have coming up at two minutes, 25 seconds, um, we're expecting to see the trunk jettison. So that claw that connects the trunk to the capsule is going to separate, allowing Dragon to uh, separate from the trunk. That's coming up in 15 seconds. And we do have the report, loss of telemetry from Falcon 9, first stage. And there you just saw the trunk jettison again. Some really loud cheers here in Hawthorne, California. This test is looking great so far. Nice view from the back of the Dragon capsule. We're also trying to see if we get the view there on the right-hand side from the aircraft that's orbiting the area. Now the Dragon control system is now going to be reorienting the capsule. We're at a high altitude where the aerodynamics are negligible. So we're going to use the small Draco thrusters on the Dragon capsule to reorient it, that gets it in a position with a heat shield down to re-enter the Earth's atmosphere and then later to deploy the drogue parachutes. <laughs> 